Hello everyone. I just wanted to talk to you today a little bit about a conference exposition center that we went to that was called the GIE. So uh, that was held in Louisville, Kentucky uh, 2021. Um, it has been going on there for years and years. And for those of you who have never went to this show, you should really go. Uh, I went for the first time myself this last year and I wish that I would have went years prior. I just didn't do it, just didn't take the time for it. Uh, usually it's in October. Um, it's usually always the 19th, 20th, 21st, I believe it is, coming up this next year. Uh, they've also changed their name to uh, the Equip Exposition is what they're calling it now, I guess. So basically the Equipment Exposition, I guess. But uh, anyway, one of the th coolest things about going to this place is you get to see all the new things that are being made. So if you go there, if you run Gravely Mowers or Skag or whatever, um, they have all their new mowers all lined up ready to go. They show you what's coming out, anything new this year, maybe new decks, new seating, new suspensions, God only knows. But it gives you a chance to see these things firsthand where you, you can't do it in a store. Like I, I remember we tried to try out some new Skags uh, up here in my neck of the woods and they got them in with zero hours on them and they didn't want to let anybody try them out. You can go down to the GIE, you can they actually have an outdoor facility out there where you can try these out. These mowers are going left and right. You can try them, excavators, mini excavators, um, all types of different tools, okay? Um, so I highly recommend you guys go check that thing out. Uh, the, one of the coolest things, like I said, is, is you go there, you get to see all the new products that are coming up. You also get to demo those things, you know, like I just talked about. So be sure to go to the outside area once you do get there. Um, you get to strategize with your peers, you know. If you get there and have it in your head when you go uh, that you want to talk to people. There's a lot of people there that'll give you their advice on things. Maybe they you're looking at certain products. These guys have already, they're, they're using those products and you can talk to them and say, hey, how do you like your echo equipment or your steel equipment or whatever? And you can get their advice on it, you know? So that's kind of nice. A lot of times we went out to lunch and uh, throughout the day and you, you'd go to some restaurant and there's a lot of guys there from the green industry. Uh, if you're from that green industry, you should go. You can meet your peers there. You guys can talk shop. It's kind of nice to be around like-minded people, you know. Um, you also get the opportunity to meet social influencers there, like from YouTube, for example. Um, I saw Brian's Lawn Maintenance down there this year. I saw, of course, Stanley Genetic uh, Dirt Monkey. He was there. Um, just wonderful talks with these guys and uh, it gives you the opportunity to to meet uh, up with your favorite influencers and you guys can talk and bullshit a little bit where you, you never get that any other place it seems you know um, I think that for me personally when I went down this last year one of the highlights of my trip was meeting people that were fans of mine and of the videos that I've done over the years and I just had a blast talking with them and sharing stories and uh, you finding out what they're all about. And a lot of times you recognize people like if, if one particular guy would call me Uncle G all the time, you know? And so you, you get to actually meet these guys. So put a face behind the, the, the little name in the comment section, you know? And I thought that was pretty cool. So if you guys, I do want to say hi to all you guys. I appreciate you coming up and talking to me. That meant the world to me. And uh, I, I like knowing that I help people with their businesses. That was the whole intention of the video. And if you guys are going to go this next year, uh, remember that this is going to be uh, in October. So it's like the 19th, 20th, and 21st. If you're going to go, get a hold of an Airbnb or something like that because the motels tend to get filled up quickly. Or call the motels now and start getting your reservations. One thing you want to do, get as close to that exposition center as possible. You want to be as close as possible, get there within walking distance if you can, or a short drive. Uh, we waited, kind of, we went at the last minute and I had to drive 20 minutes just to get there. And so, you know, and you're in heavy interstate traffic. So I highly recommend you guys do that. And hopefully I'll see you guys there. And if you do, come up and say hi. Thank you. The city lights and illuminate and brighten I let it in and let it out I feel the summer in the air It's summer
found the freedom 